Hello, welcome to our first of many sandbox development videos. I'm Sam Ichimonahihi Aliubi from the Eagle One development team. And I'm uh, here with uh, GCAF and Generic Icon uh, who are uh, hanging out in this uh, sandbox level that Generic has constructed as we uh, begin to mess around with uh, early access and really dive into the nitty gritty of the uh, Half-Life development tools. There is a lot of stuff that we are excited to be able to show you guys as it pertains to sandbox sandbox and uh, your ability to take the things that we're learning and hopefully use it for your own creative abilities. Um, this is right now in a super early stage. I want to stress out that uh, if you're someone who's looking to jump in the sandbox and play it immediately, um, there's a really big reason why it is limited to developers. Um, but what we're hoping is that what we have to go through, the trials and tribulations, is uh, going to be able to benefit you as we continue to make these videos about the things that we find and as well as the things that we've already learned. Um, so without further ado, to start this off, I've gone ahead and um, I've created uh, a set of blocks, if you will. Let me just go ahead and uh, switch on out here. Uh, that is going to be available uh, for everybody to go ahead and download and use. And so this is actually made up entirely of prefabs. And uh, this uh, set of prefabs are able to connect together to give you these levels and uh, these blockouts that are very quick um, for people who are looking to develop for Sandbox. If uh, you don't want to spend time trying to make some hallways and corridors and big rooms, um, this is going to be easy for you to just go ahead and plop down and create yourself. Um, <clears throat> the uh, different uh, meshes and sets, uh, as shown right here, are uh, built on grid. And so all you have to do is just simply snap them into place, uh, line up the door frames, and uh, you'll be able to go ahead and immediately test out whatever game mode that you want. Um, I'm excited to, to get this out there. I'm hoping that those of you who download it can also, if you want to look at the details, um, I have smoothed some of the edges uh, so that way you can uh, look at how the face work uh, will allow you to hopefully take what we've taught you through the tutorials and really either put it to use here uh, by learning the architecture or by just simply connecting these together to be able to get something quickly out of it. Um, now I am going to be uh, continuing to build these uh, for uh, other game types as well. So this is going to be a generic pack that anyone can use. Um, but I'm really looking forward to building some race uh, track meshes as well uh, so people can be able to go ahead and piece it together. Um, and uh, there's pool tables, there's miniature golf. Really, uh, this is a really exciting time and uh, the development team here at Eagle One is going to continue to do what we can uh, to push this engine to its absolute limits. Um, so I hope that you guys can find uh, use for this. I'm going to go ahead and uh, release this. Uh, there'll be a link in the YouTube channel so that way you can go in and download this. Um, but we're going to, as we continue along, uh, de uh, develop and release uh, whatever we can to help you uh, within that process. All right. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, I'm looking forward to seeing what creations you can come up with. Uh, all of these are, are able to be just easily moved around and a snap into place um, that uh, if you want to texture it, this is easily texturable. I'm hoping to see some different variations too uh, for those of you that do choose to use this set. Now this isn't a tile mesh set, okay? So you can't go in and, and create faces and, and extrude it out. That'd actually be a quite a, a nice step to take in the next direction. Um, but uh, definitely, uh, if you do end up using this in some capacity, I'd love to see it swing by our Discord, jump in a voice chat, and uh, make sure that uh, you show us uh, what you've been doing if you have any questions as well we'd be more than happy to help all right uh, i'm going to be going ahead and uh, signing off but i'm uh, looking forward to our second one uh, we're going to be having several of these videos where we show the development process as well so this is the final product i didn't quite film the building of this as uh, throughout the day i'd been intermittently going in and out uh, but for the next videos we'll go ahead we'll show you how we make the uh, game modes how we make the levels how we make the assets um, and put them into this wonderful engine all right we'll see you guys on our next video. Have a great day.